So I'm pretty excited to share this with all of you. Untitled Goose Game has come out physically on the Nintendo Switch. And I tried this game a long time ago at my friend's house. He bought it digitally and I was like, oh, I'll get it eventually. But I really wanted to hold out in case there was a physical. Finally, we have one. So yeah, worth it. It came with a few little neat things inside, some swag, if you will. Just stoked. Untitled Goose Game, physically out on the Nintendo Switch. The two-player mode has been added. Uh, hopefully we'll try that out soon. We'll probably do that on stream when I can have a friend over to play that. But let's just, let's just check this out, guys. Let's check it out. You know, I love how, like, simple it is. Two players there. We're gonna play Save 01. That's gonna be us right now. We're loading. Slowly but surely we're getting in there. Oh, you wanted to hear the meows of my cats? Most people have other distracting sounds in the backgrounds of their videos, but you know what? I've got cats. And that's okay. I love the honking. Oh, geez. You know, the first thing I really liked about this game was definitely the art style. It's so unique. I, I think it was kind of like the first real time of seeing something like this when I when I saw it advertised I was like this could be interesting we have a boot I don't know why we have a boot but we do bend down to pick things up off the ground oh does it want us to pick up the oh we could probably pick up this can yeah here we go you know we're uh, we're just we're just cleaning up the town man we're we're a goose on a mission I don't I don't think we can take that oh we have a ball see like Look how responsible we are. I, th I think we're quite responsible. I really like the art style. I said I, I, I loosely checked it out before, but now I have to actually check it out and see what this game is really like. I think, I think, it's, I think it's cool that they, they really developed a... Uh, <laughs> honk. They really developed a two-player mode. That's, that's pretty cool. Oh, can I spread my wings too? Ward off intruders. Oh, I like that intro. That's nice. This is my first real look at this game, because friend just had me try out like a little area when this game first came out. I'm so happy this came out physically for the Switch. It's it's so unique of a game. And and I really hope more developers take note of that. Please make games where we play as random animals. And and just make it just make it like this. It's a it's a simple game, you know. Again, the art style is, I love it. We can just hang out. Can we just swim all day? Do we even need to do anything else to advance the game? Okay, so we we can we can actually move quite quickly. <gasps> Maybe we're hungry. Are we hungry? <laughs> really awesome that they animated uh, the water coming off of stuff. Here we go. Oh, you wanted to have a picnic? Tis my picnic now, humans! They weren't, like, there was no one here. They they, they clearly weren't enjoying it anyway. Take this apple with me. It's gonna <laughs> ruin their day. Leave half the sandwich, because we're not, we're not that evil, you know what I mean? This is so cute. Like I said, I think, I think there should be more games like this. There should be more games like this. Can we get, like, a, a moose game? Okay, that's locked. Although you just like flop. Run and flop, little one. Now to terrorize the good citizens of whatever this town is called. Didn't quite get the memo there. Oh? We have a farmer! Must be enjoying your day, farmer. Must be hard when I take your soil here. Controls are pretty straightforward. <gasps> what are you? Yes! Okay. Don't mind me. Don't mind me, just do your thing. <laughs> he did not, he did not like that. He was, he was not for that. Okay, okay, so we have a list to do. 
Get into the garden. Get the groundskeeper wet. Steal the groundskeeper's keys. May the groundskeeper wear his sun hat. Rake in the lake. Have a picnic. Bring the picnic blanket sandwich. Okay. Oh, bring to the picnic blanket. Sandwich, apple, pumpkin, carrot, jam. There was Here I was. Doing terrible things. Can I even... I can't reach that hat, can I? Tell what I can't reach. Just rake. We need to put the rake in the lake. Nope! Sir, we do not need you here. No, come on. He's really gonna... Go do your thing, buddy. You go do what you need to do. I'm gonna take this rake to my lake. I'm gonna take this rake to my lake. I was really, I was really certain he was gonna come get it. All right, mine now, mine now, pal. You're not, you're not getting that. They can turn quickly if you let go of B. Okay, okay. There, so there's a blanket. There is. Okay, so we need to go back for the basket. And I think the apple. Because I thought it would be a great idea to throw everything in the lake. So we need apple, pumpkin, carrot, jam, thermos, radio. There was nothing about a sandwich, right? No. It's funny how something so simple can really be complex in its own ways. And I dig that. I dig that, Mr. Goose. Okay, pumpkin, carrot, jam, thermos. Well, we want him to get wet, right? So we need him... Let's take a carrot. No big deal. No! Aha! Does that count? Does he take... If he takes it away, does it count? Dang it! Oh wait, you know what? <laughs> if I get, if I take the carrot and I take the carrot to the lake, where's your rake, homeboy? He's not gonna go. There's no, there's no way, cause like the sandwich is still there, right? Okay, so we we know now what's gonna happen. We know that he's not going to go for the carrot, right? There's no, there's no way he goes for the carrot. I just, I need to see, he's putting his rake back. We gotta, we gotta see, is he? Oh yeah, he's going for it. Go on, buddy. Get your carrot. Ha ha! Surprise! <laughs> he's, uh, he's like, you know, how long till he just decides, uh... I'm gonna take this uh, take this goose down on a step. So where is this where you put the radio? Okay, we also need. I don't care about the cooler. Wait, I can't I can't get the jam, can I? I want to get the jam. He's so he's distracted. And take the jam. See, I'm... I'm just... I'm just thinking big brain here. Big goose brain. See, what we need to do is we need to move these items where they are. Into the water. So he can't get them. So now... How are we gonna get that... The thermos? Okay, so we got the thermos. Alright. So now we just need... Pumpkin. Right? I think so. Oh, we, we do need the radio. I feel like the radio is going to be like our last kind of ditch effort here. What's up? Don't mind me. Just being a goose. Oh, wow. We're oh, no. The pumpkins. 
Okay, what's he gonna get up to next? What's he doing next? What are you doing next? Nope! Nope, nope, nope! See, we're, we're gonna drop that. We're gonna beeline it, because we know. He'll mess around with that stuff first. If he goes for his trowel... Dang it! Come on, come on, come on. Go for his keys. <laughs> He's gonna keep going for the pumpkin! Go on. <laughs> Dude, bro, I'm gonna keep taking your keys. See if I distract him with this other pumpkin. Take that pumpkin. Take that pumpkin back. Take that pumpkin. Don't even worry about it. Don't even sweat it. That's fine. Nothing to see here. Just a goose stealing all your stuff. Okay. Now, for the fun part. Wait, so it doesn't count that we took his keys, does it? Yeah. I guess that's all you have to do. Uh, we need the radio. So... Let's really mess with him. And just destroy this man's whole garden. His whole livelihood just gone in one fell swoop. Let's, uh... <laughs> What's the matter? Not gonna get wet? <laughs> Wait, really? Really? Okay, so he's not like... He's only aware that I put it there because I brought attention to it. Don't worry about it, dude. Now I'm, now I'm wondering if I can pull off the entire thing, right? The greatest heist of all time. A picnic. Just for me. See, I guess once with your checklist, it's not a big deal, but I feel like I should take the radio last. Because the radio makes noise, and the radio is just going to bring him and his infinite wisdom. Too bad he can't just trap him. That's okay. We're, we're outsmarting the, uh... We're outsmarting you. I mean, I destroyed his radio. That was the smart thing. Oh, the sandwich. Silly me, how could I forget the sandwich? <laughs> the radio still counts, even though it's soaked. I'm okay with this. Alright. Oh, like, the full sandwich? Not just half. Oh. That's fair, I suppose. Ha! Huh. See, we had a picnic by ourselves. A new to-do list. Make the groundskeeper hammer his thumb. Come on, let's just... That's just smart. That's some some big brain there. I'm not really sure how. Wait. Don't mind me. I meant to get the keys! <laughs> how am I supposed to get the sun? The sun hat's something interesting. I'm not really sure how we're supposed to get the sun hat, but... Come on, man. Don't worry about it. It's fine. It's fine. It's perfectly fine. He's got his feet. He's got everything. Everything in the world he can need. 
No, I'm not. I'm not doing anything wrong. I feel like I would be, you know, stronger. Maybe I'm wrong. So that would be the uh, the other thing to do. Make him wear his sun hat. Not really sure, but we'll figure it out. So honestly, playing playing a few minutes into this game, giving this game a first look, you know, seeing its mechanics and that into play. This game is a lot of fun. There's a unique charm that just carries this title, and I'm really excited to see more of it. In fact, we're going to be doing a full playthrough on the live stream, so make sure to tune in when we stream Thursdays through Sundays uh, to see what games we end up playing. There's going to be a lot of, lot of Nintendo stuff coming, so I think we'll leave it for here. And we'll look into getting the two-player action going in the near future to see how that handles in comparison. I'm very excited to play more of this game. I enjoy it. I think the game has a lot to offer. I think that a title Goose Game is just something that hits all the right notes with a unique title. And the developers did an awesome job of bringing something different to the table when it came to video games. So I highly recommend checking this game out when you can, digitally or physically now, and across multiple platforms. Thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you all like this. Let me know what you think about the First Looks format. I want to do this for every new title I pick up from the Nintendo Switch and even uh, soon the PlayStation 5. I'd love to do these First Look videos to get a general impressions and let you know my thoughts on the game. Thanks so much for tuning in once again. Please like, comment, and subscribe. It helps me out a lot, and I'll see all of you in the next video.